Where did you even come from? How are we even talking? How the fuck should I know? The fuck kind of joy toy are you supposed to be? Fucking ghost off! Who you work for, start talking! Fuck! Fuck. Fucking chip. Rip the thing out myself! No, wait! I'll find a way. You hear me? See you never, asshole. Now like that, stick some iron in your mouth and pull the trigger. I can feel it. Our minds touch it. I'm like mold on fruit, creeping into you. Nothing I can do about it. You hear me? I'd puke if I fucking could. It's just a copy of the engram. I'm out there somewhere. Gotta be. Tajemura here. We must meet. Come to Thomas Diner. Hmm. Why would I do that? Because I am the one who saved your life. Haven't managed to get my head straight yet. Not after everything that happened. That will not happen anytime soon. Hang on, dude. Gotta go. What? Okay, you were saying? That will not happen anytime soon. And so what? If 
for you in fact to leave. You must re-enter the awful room. Place. The bell has already tolled. Thomas Diner, I am waiting. Oh shit, not good. Warren. Then find them! Cut the uh, bullshit! Just open up! I need those flowers. We came here That's as colleagues. It. Nothing else. Haven't heard from you in a while. We're worried. No. Now leave me alone. Congrats, Mendez. Way to be a prick. Oh, what? So I'm the bad guy? I'm not the one who's holed up, playing the attention. not the first or the last. Up, huh? It's called life. What's going on? I live right upstairs. Just keep on living. Stop minding other people's biz. Mendez, hold on. It's his neighbor. Is there anything I can do? Maybe. You know Barry at all? More or less. Struck up a convo once or twice. He's a friend from the precinct. Left the force not long ago. He broke down after his best friend died. We're worried he'll do something stupid. Relax, Petrova. Barry's got nerves of steel. He's just a spiteful old bastard. Mendez! Could you check on him when he's chilled down? Sure, why not? Not like we're miles apart. Thanks. Just be patient. Cops falling and rough times can be touchy. I'll see what I can do. Hey, Barry? Everything all right in there? I'm gonna take that as a yes. <sighs> Try again later. Barry? Am I remembering that right? Who is it? V, your neighbor from upstairs. Remember me? Talked about Prem rides. Back then, you were pumped about the Mizutani Shion. I said it was for flash posers. <laughs> you don't forget a gunk thing like that. You gave me this look. I was about to hightail it to the Badlands right then and there. I remember. What do you want? Just want to talk, that's all. I know it's what you need right now, but you don't want to admit it. I can't turn back time for you, but I can sit next to you and listen. Remind you that you're not in this alone. Now, hold on a sec. We barely know each other, and you just rock up here talking to me about my problems. Where'd you get the idea something with me was up? You watching me? Someone sent you? <laughs> You got me. Your friends asked me to drop in on you, so I thought, hey, why not? He's a stand-up guy. Who cares if he has shitty taste when it comes to street shredders? Come back just to get your ass kicked. Man, you really know how to cheer a guy up. Maybe those two assets really are worried about me. All right, come on in. Wanna talk, so let's talk. I lost someone close to me, too. Damn good friend. What do you mean, too? Wait. It's about Andrew. He, uh... Told you about him. Best bud I ever had. Known in my whole life. Only person I could spill to without being judged. You didn't have anyone to unload on at work? How about Petrova and Mendez? Petrova's a decent gal, but she's not good with this stuff. Mendez just doesn't get it. He thinks us blues need to be tough. 
Can't bear the sight of a kid getting murdered. Born with pussy genes. According to him. But you told him about Andrew. Honestly? Thought about it a lot. Anyway, they don't know everything. Better that way. Can you tell me how Andrew died? Does it matter? Normally, from old age. It's no wonder, seeing as he was only a few years younger than my grandma. Dying of old age? In Night City, that merits a monument. Whole world should gaze up at it now. <laughs> Ashbox and the niche will have to do. Mendez doesn't know shit about life. Everyone's got their limits, even him. He just hasn't reached them. Not like you. What if he's right, though? Maybe my genes are soft. Don't only the strongest survive. If you felt nothing, that means his loss wouldn't have had any meaning. I guess so. Thanks for the talk, V. I, um... I need time to take all this in. Sure thing. Take care. peacefully in his sleep. The exact cause of his death has not been released, but initial reports suggest coronary implant failure. The remainder of Mayor Ryan's term will be supported by his deputy mayor and closest associate. Something feels off here. You don't say. I don't mean the wreck, I mean the run. City's most courteous chauffeur up and drives away from the scene of an accident. So bad. Then, in the car, I doubted you would survive. 
What's it you actually want from me? To begin, you must tell me where to find Evelyn Parker. Evelyn? What's she to you? She and Yorino Arasaka had intimate relations. She knows how to get to him. Been thinking I ought to have a word with her myself. She promised to help me get rid of the chip. I would not count on that. She's likely gone very far away. Just answered your own question about where Evelyn is. Long gone. Why do you believe she could help you remove the chip? Does a corporation help her? Got no clue. Evelyn was knowledgeable about the relic. Had a large chunk of classified info. An enigma, to be sure, but... She showed that slyness you get in corpo agents. You know the kind. I too possess this slyness you speak of. You got tossed out lumped with the outcasts easily. Or have you forgotten? Hmm. Sorry, I couldn't be of any help. Don't have any time to lose. B, so. wait. I need you. Yorinobu Arasaka must answer for this crime of patricide. <laughs> Looking for justice? In Night City? I seek revenge. Much more feasible here. I have allies prepared to bring Yorinobu to his knees. The only thing I need is proof. And you think? They'll trust the word of a merc? I have nothing better now. Also, I know no one here. And I am a fugitive. I am hunted. So what, we stroll into Arasaka HQ and announce that Yorinobu's a kin killer? That he murdered Saburo? We'll get the hearing before reasonable people in a neutral location. Certain... Procedures will be used to establish the truth. A lie detector? Forget it. In that case, another option. You are dying. You do not know how to save yourself. A chip, the relic, is a culprit. Technology made by Arasaka. Technology they alone know. This cooperation can save you as easily as it can make you disappear. It is merely about getting the right people on your side. Politics. You mean people like Anders Hellman? You know this name? How? Prepped for the heist thoroughly. Relic is Hellman's design, his creation. And true, he's a pawn. I was thinking of one much more powerful. Besides, and does Hellman escape to Arasaka? Betrayed it. Hanako sama, oai tekete koe des. Kochira koso. Now, Hanako sama, I would first like to ask you. Saka scums everywhere. Hey, I was listening to that. Shut up. Nobody except you wants to watch that shit about that corpo cunt. What did you say? You heard me. Let it go, Takamura. Hmm. At least one of you's got some fucking sense. Tom's all right. Not afraid to speak his mind, that's all. He reminds me of my father. He also worked in a kitchen all his life. Thanks for the offer. Need to think about it. Get back to you. I need time to plan, organize. You stand to gain much if you help me. All I ask is that you do not leave the city. Leave? Why would I leave? Need help. Best chance I'll find the right person here. Someone other than Arasaka specialist? There's no one. No alternative. Actually, we just talked about some. 
With a bit of luck, I'll track down Evelyn. If she could not help you before, she will not manage to now. Honor among thieves. Ever heard of it? Yes, I thought it ironic. Thieves have none. There's just honor, I believe. You're an Obu Arasaka degree? I'm sure. The Paka woman will not help you. Why are you? I would think about a plan B. Anders Hellman. He invented the relic. If I want to get rid of it, he's my man. And if that means picking another fight with Arasaka, so be it. Hellman defected from the company. I myself spent many days looking for him. He... What's the expression? Dropped off the face of the earth. Why are you looking for Hellman? He was the one to alert Saburo-san to Yorinobu's schemes. He knew both of them well and could be an important witness. Corporal Rad squeal when hanging by their tails. For several days, I collected the information. All leads point to one place, the club called the Afterlife. I was quickly dismissed by the Queen of Fixers there, Rogue. Mean to say you worked for Saboro, yet got no idea how to talk to the High and Mighty. She wished to have nothing to do with the man accused of murdering Saburo Arasaka. Rogue's well informed. Gets wind to most things that happen in the city. Might be worth asking her about Hellman. I wish you luck. The old mine is choosy, expensive, and rude. I cannot stay here any longer. Do what you want. Look for Parker, Hellman, whoever. I must see some friends, call in some favors. When my people in Arasaka are ready to listen, I will call you. Till then, I guess. If by some miracle you find Hellman, please notify me. He and I have unfinished business. Zapper dumples and filth. In some ways, Night City never changes. Arasaka oh, still a despotic machine, and the world's on a collision course with chaos. But hey, at least Rogue's still alive. You know, you've got some nerve. First you're out to kill me, now you want to be my pal and make like nothing happened? You know you don't gotta speak out loud to talk to me. What do you want? And I've processed some shit, changed my mind. Don't want you dead anymore. Go fuck yourself, dick wipe. Hey, wasn't easy for me either. You woke up in a landfill, I woke up in your head. Wrestling with your thoughts, memories. Think we're even. And I've taken a step back, looked at things. Think we might be able to help each other. We could start with Rogue. Her and I go back to the Stone Age. You are the ghost of Christmas past, asshole. Any friends you've had are either dead or so old their memory's gone. Johnny Silverhand died a legend. Nobody forgets that. So you fucking know Rogue. What would I say to her? I got a talking brain tumor claims it's her old friend Johnny? Trust me, Rogue's heard dumber shit than that. Way back when you weren't even an itch in your daddy's ball sack. Don't need convincing. Seen your memories. Gross. Rogel danced any tune I play or just get us to the afterlife. There is no us. Hey, look. Hey, friend. You good? Would you look at that? You see it too, right? Either gone completely whacked or I'm having a mystical moment. What's that chick's name? The one with the hair? Misty? Nah. More likely a neuron misfire for Victor to check out. Um, maybe ask them both.
Lady? That you? Shit. I thought you were gone. Listen, need to find Evelyn. I really don't want to talk about her. Know where she is? What I just say. Drop it. I won't tell you again. What? Can we meet? Let's meet, please. You at Lizzie's? Services. Gotta track a guy down. Mm-hmm. Anders Hellman. Hotshot engineer worked for Arasaka. Millisec. Anders Hellman. Pinpoint him for me. Thanks. Jump in too soon. First, my help's got a price. Second and third. Dexter Deshawn. Jackie Wells. T Multiple bells ring in V. Left a lot of bodies behind. Death walks in your wake. Chalk that up to bad luck? There's the bitch I know. Ask her about Saga Tower. How they shot me up right in front of her. They knew the risks. All sorts of shit happens. To all sorts of people. Even to the best. Do you too, Rogue? Arasaka Tower. Remember? Who'd you lose back then? Johnny something? Ah. You came prepped. Of course. Anyways, feelings be damned, I've always said. This is pure biz. You need my help, so get those eddies ready. Mm-hmm. See? Oh, 
Should be enough. Mm-hmm. Come back tomorrow. We'll talk. Hey, interested in some work?